Managing Emotions, Defining Stress and Anxiety. Hello, English learners. In today's lesson, we're going to delve into the world of emotions, specifically focusing on stress and anxiety. These are common feelings everyone experiences, especially during test preparations. So, let's get started by understanding their definitions. Stress is a reaction of the body and mind to a challenge or demand. We all deal with stress on a daily basis. It might come from taking a test, managing work tasks, or even having an argument. The feeling you get, that tightening in your chest or the racing of your heart, that's your body's response to a demand. In small amounts, stress can be beneficial, like when it helps you avoid danger or meet a deadline. But when you're constantly running in emergency mode, your body can suffer. Key points. Stress is a reaction to challenges or demands. It can be beneficial in small amounts. Constant stress can be harmful. Now, let's talk about anxiety. Anxiety is a feeling of worry, nervousness, or unease about something with an uncertain outcome. It's like that fluttery feeling in your stomach before a big presentation or awaiting test results. It's perfectly natural to feel anxious about such moments. However, if you feel anxious most of the time and struggle to remember the last time you felt relaxed, you might be dealing with an anxiety disorder. Key points. Anxiety is a feeling of worry or unease. It often arises from uncertain outcomes. Regular and intense anxiety may be a sign of an anxiety disorder. Now you might wonder, are stress and anxiety the same thing? Not quite. While they share similarities, they're distinct. Think of stress as a response to a specific external trigger, like a looming exam, while anxiety is a reaction to that stress, which can persist even after the trigger is gone. Key points. Stress is a response to an external trigger. Anxiety is a reaction to that stress. Anxiety can persist even without a clear trigger. In summary, while stress and anxiety might seem like giant hurdles, especially during exam preparation, understanding them is the first step to managing and overcoming them. We hope today's lesson helps shed light on these emotions. Remember, it's okay to seek help if they become overwhelming. Happy learning until next time. Stay curious and stay positive.